Hi, I'm Phil Anderson, and I'm running for United States Senate to represent Wisconsin. My family and I watched the movie Mockingjay Part 2 tonight. I highly recommend it. Great movie. But near the beginning of the movie, one of the characters had some lines that really caught my attention. She said, why are we fighting each other? They've turned the best of us against each other. Turn your weapons to the Capitol. Now, I'm not advocating any sort of armed insurrection against uh, the, the government of the United States. But it did really bring home to me uh, the idea, the truth, that we are constantly being divided by what we hear in the media, what we're told to believe politically, how we classify ourselves, whether it's classifying ourselves by upper class, middle class, lower class, right and left, conservative and liberal. And some very, very bright, talented people spend a lot of time uh, taking sides and trying to shoot arrows at the other side, trying to win arguments, trying to gain control of the political apparatus um, to, to prove their point. When in fact, the real divisions in our society and our economy are between those who produce wealth and those who take it from us, basically the government and, the, and, the, uh, and their cronies. So what I would hope we would do, and what I'll try to talk about over the next few months, is how we can take back our government, not by arrows, of course, but by taking a very close look at what's actually going on between the wealth-producing class and those who take our wealth and not be distracted by those artificial divisions that don't really mean so much. After all, we're all just people trying to do our best in the world, provide for our families, have jobs, be productive, live our lives, be free to express ourselves. All the things that we have in common is what we should be concentrating on, not those things that divide us, not the narratives that are intended to divide us so that the government can basically extract wealth from us through taxation, uh, through inflation and printing more money, um, those sorts of things. So let's concentrate on the positive, but make sure that we understand what the real divisions in our society and our economy are. So thanks for your time, and I'll talk to you again tomorrow night.